Hello, my people. I welcome you all to watch this video. Please share this video as you watch. I want to talk to my fellow women out there. There are things women do that turns off men. Things we do that makes our men to be angry with us. And it makes them to turn off from us. Yes, number one. Nagging. If you are a woman and you always nag, you always disturb men, you always harass them. Get ready to lose that relationship. Get ready to lose that man. Because you keep on frustrating this man. Anytime he remembers to come home, he remember, oh, I have a nagging wife at home. Oh, I have a nagging girlfriend. He would not like to be with you. He would not like to be seeing you often. Sometimes we ladies, we have an important issue to present to our husband, to present to our man. But sometimes we present it at the wrong time. Okay? So, my fellow women, watch your man, watch your husband. Whenever he's upset, don't discuss important issues with him. Allow him to be. Two. Two. I owe him mentality. I owe that man. He is my man. It's a lie. You don't owe him. You don't owe that man. Because before he met you, he has a life. He has, a, he has friends. He has a family. He has a relationship before he met you. Okay? So, he chooses you to be with you does not mean that he doesn't love others. Before he met you, he has families. He has even friends. Don't take because he chose you to be with you and you think and believe that you can change him totally. No. You know, men are egoistic in nature. When you think you can trap them down, they will tell you no. Be submissive and respectful. That is what brings the beauty in you. When you, when you are submissive to your man and you respect your man. Stop checking their phone every time because you owe him. It's my man, I owe him. It's my husband. Nobody owe him. I will dictate for him. You keep on checking his phone. You want to know where he is. You want to know what he is doing. You want to know who he is speaking with. You want to know who he is staying with. My dear, you're getting it wrong. It pisses them off. It pisses them off. They will see it as if you are pestering their life. You are dictating for them. You cannot imprison them. Okay? So if you are a type that is doing this, change from today to have a peaceful home. Number three. Number three thing that women do that make their man to be turned away from them is dirtiness. Dirtiness. Women try to look good, no matter how small. Try to shave yourself, shave your armpits, shave all the areas that you need to keep clean. Brush your mouth. Some has mouth odor. If you have mouth odor, it's treatable. There are some things you use. Clean up yourself. Look good. Look neat. Look sexy. Look sweet. For your man okay men hate dirtiness dirty environment dirty kitchen dirty everywhere they will come into the house the house is dirty the bed is dirty no it makes them to always leave the house leave the house okay so take note of that number four lies 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 stop telling your man lies be truthful in all that you are doing with that man Men hate lies. Living a life of lie is very difficult. But living a life of truthfulness is very simple. 
If you lie today, will you lie tomorrow? You might lie today and forget that. Tomorrow you will say the truth and he will know that. So you lie to me then. It doesn't like men, women that lie. It turns them off. Okay? So take note of that. Number four. Stop walking out of your man when he's speaking to you. Your man will come in and say, honey, I want to talk to you. Let's do this, this, this. Concerning one particular thing. Because you're annoyed or maybe you don't like that discussion, you walk out without uttering a word. It pisses them off. It shows that you are disrespecting him. Stop that. It turns them off. Yes. Stop doing that. Number four, stop cutting your cutting phone on them when they are speaking with you. They will call you on phone to discuss with you, and because maybe the discussion got you annoyed, you bang the call. Oh my god. It makes them feel crazy. Don't do that. If you really want to keep that man, avoid this. Even if you are hot-tempered, even if he did the worst to you, calm down and listen. In fact, keep quiet. He will be the one to call that call. Okay. Another one is bad sex. No, let me come... Um, there's another point. Let, let me conclude with bad sex. Another one that this man of is too serious, over seriousness. Every time you squeeze off your face, every time you become serious, not being playful. How can a man stay with his boss in the office and come back to the house and still meet another boss? No. Play with your man. Feel free. Don't be too serious. He calls you baby. Let that tenderness, let that baby in you be seen in your actions. Men love pampering. They have a mother that pampered them. So they will, they will always like you to pamper them. That is all they need from you. It's not when he thought, no, 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 I don't want to, no, no, no. Oh, my goodness. Stop being too serious. Okay? Let him see that tenderness in you. Mm, that baby is sticking you. He calls it baby. So you portray that. They love it. Okay? Then let me come to the last one. Let me conclude with this one. Bad sex. I'm going to be raw in this. Bad sex kills relationship. Bad sex turns men off. Some of you are there. When your man is having sex with you on the bed, you just you just stay like that, like a like a dead person. Like bread mima. Women. Hear this. If you don't know how to fuck the hell out of your man, get ready to lose that man. Okay? You have to turn him off on bed. You have to fuck his brain out of him. Don't lie down there like a stick. Man doesn't like it. It doesn't move them. You make the man only the man to do the work. Only him to do the work. Do you think it is easy? So some of you will be doing a million, maca, million, maca. If I if I react now, if I do this, if I make move, if I do this, that he, he will think maybe you are wayward. You are a liar. You are a liar. Even those that the GO, mommy GO, if they don't sex their man very well, the man will keep on looking for side chick. This is why most men sometimes, they will go to their office and have sex in the office with their girlfriend, with their colleagues. Just because when they come back to the house to enjoy with their woman, their woman will not give 
them the best of it. The woman will not give them moves. The woman will not, oh my God, turn them on. You have to turn your man on. You make him so that he will want you all the time. You make him so that when he remember home, he'll be running down to come and meet the wife. It will make him not even to look into another woman. Yes. Hear me. Bad sex kills relationship. Good sex keeps man. Share this video. I pray that you will not fall a victim of all this. Please share this video so that you get to others. Comment, like, and share. God bless you. I love you all. Mm.